This video is on the Tiger 2H in War Thunder, featuring a 15 kill game and showing off why this Tiger is still the king of 6.7. Hope you guys enjoy this short spoiler free intro featuring the 262 Narval. He's still there. Yeah, Char 25 would have been scary. The amount of times I've bounced these stupid things with things that shouldn't bounce. There goes my gunner. My loader's not dead though. What on earth was that that hit me? What the hell is going on? Oh, I'm being Frenchman. With snebs. I'm, I'm wondering why my tanks bouncing up and down so much. Narval. There's a lot of 20 mils. I do not want to be here. Thank you very much, boys. 109k. That that eh, F4U7 is still there as well. Oh, I think he just lost his tail or a flap or something. He's still kind of no, he's not flying at all. That man is pan bread. Or I'll just ammo rack him or two knock him out. That's cool too. I got quite a few. Oh, we need to help this tiger to age. I was fighting somebody in the smoke. Hold on, bud, I'm coming. I want to try. There's a R3 pushing this guy, too. Let's get the first one. Right, he can't do anything with that breach out. There's another one. North tank. This guy. I think I got that guy's breach, too. Yeah. So they're all damaged. The R3 died. I'm coming, bud. Yes, okay, perfect. Guten Tag and welcome back to the channel. Today, we have some very interesting games in the Tiger 2H. And by interesting, I mean bloody massacres. This is one of the best stat tanks I have in War Thunder. And why? It's because it's a Tiger 2. Now I hear the wearables screaming about how this thing suffers in up tiers, but really, in a full up tier, it's not that bad. Of course, Britons have their fully stabilized APDS boys, but there's no reason why you shouldn't be able to just shoot them and send them back to the hangar in one shot. This thing has an absolutely ludicrous amount of armor on its hull. And when facing off against USA, there's sometimes not much they can really do with this turret in cheek either. Of course, if you're flanked or you exposed to much of your side, you're definitely going to die. But the same could be said about any tank. Now, the King Tiger isn't slow either, for a heavy tank, it's actually pretty fast. The gun handling on this thing is fantastic, and I absolutely adore the Long 88. It has an insane amount of pen for an APHG round, and it's really easy to aim because it travels so fast. This round covers an entire kilometer in less than one and a half seconds, meaning it's really easy to lead moving targets too. Now, I'm sure anybody else who brings out the Tiger 2 you mostly get killed by bombs. And if that's not the case for you and you keep dying to opponents who shouldn't be able to kill you easily, here's a couple of quick tips for you just so you know how to play this. One, if it's a 7-7 game, don't bring this tank out. Use something that's lighter and has a higher penetrating round. I cannot recommend the M41 Bulldog enough. And two, if you decide to take your King Tiger, Put yourself up against the side of a building so one side of your hull is completely covered and you're only exposing your upper front plate and lower front plate. When you've fired at your enemy, make sure you turn your turret at an angle. That will make things much harder for them to pen you. And number three, don't drive this thing around the battlefield with your head cut off. You are 100% going to die to an M18. Now, towards the end of the match, people will start spawning lesser tanks in desperation to win games and that's when you can start pulling off some pretty crazy maneuvers. 75 Shermans, 76 Shermans, even 85mm Russians just can't do anything to you from the front. And then, and only then, do you go into full bully mode and go for those high kill games. What I'm trying to tell you is, you're not Whitman. Anyway, let's head into battle and I'll show you how it's done. Okay, quite a small map. <laughs> I'll always check that spawn someone that... Some people actually flip upside down when they spawn there, depending on the vehicle. With Russia, I, I normally like facing Russia more. 
Uh, quite easy to kill with a long 88. And they don't do very damage to a King Tiger. Right. Things we don't want to get shot at with. T-92s and Scorpions. There are a lot of guys going behind the cliffs. Which is exactly why I'm going this way. So how quickly they get there. We got a Bulldog going that way, so... I can keep facing this direction. Oh, we reach the top of the hill, hopefully. Oh, he just died. There's a T-34 up here. Something was on B as well. Or still is. Just capped the point. Hello, young lad. That was a scorpion. That was not ideal for that guy. There's another one here. Poor M6. Who's smoking this? It's a guy rushing A. Very poor hit on him, but he's definitely F. <laughs> Pretty bad. That guy's dead. That's a dead friendly, actually. I might get shot from behind shortly. This is a much more intense game. Who's this jumble at? I want to know if we stopped him in his tracks. Come on. Bugger off, smoke. No, we did not. What do we got? Is this 12 and an IS-2 over there? Okay, might not shot him. This panther got a hit. Oh. That was a really laggy shot, dude. I clicked my mouse button to fire and my gun didn't shoot for ages. Oh, never mind. There's a few things coming this way. Well, that bulldog's now shooting at me too. What are, what are you doing? I hit him the only place I couldn't pen him. Of course. I need that guy to shoot again. Way over the top. You just shot my oh, this artillery. Of course it was. Somebody's flanking me too. I, mean, I don't want to peek that side again. I don't want to get dragged too far out like that. Artillery is just a guaranteed track now. I mean, this guy's swinging around this way, so I made the right choice. There's that M4 I missed the Bulldog before. Five seconds before I can drive out in front of this guy. To the map. I need to know what this dude wants to do. Smoking that way. Oh, this is intense. Oh, damn. It's a big boy right there, too. My gun is aiming at the smoke. God, the smoke is expanding right in front of me, too. Go away. Right, he's sent. Oh. This is a pretty wild game. This guy is not doing a very good job here. The Centurion. 
Somebody just shot him actually. <laughs> Can I ping him? He's dead. Good. Let's go. Need the beak up right now. That's bombs. Well, there was my track again. P47 wasting his bombs. Thank you very much, Panda. Thank you. Right, let's get this cap, dude. Me and you. Let's go. Jumbo down there. I don't need to help get this cap anymore. Oh, what are you shooting at? You killed him. Sherman. Dead Waffentrager over here. I'm not interested in this cat. I need better positioning. Poor dude. Nothing he can do to me other than annoy me. This guy as well. He just took a shot. A bulldog is very dead. Okay. Through cover of smoke, let's help this panther push up now. Absolute massacre. M18 just killed my friendly. Probably from behind, actually. Where? The enemy spotted. And that. My shot went right over the top of him. By a millimeter, I think. Really bad hit on that Jackson. I'm gonna die. This is not good. I want to get out of the way of this plane. Missed again. Chaffee. Not really scared of the 75 from behind. That one I'm scared of though. Okay, guns up. Perfect. That guy's dead. And I think this match is now ours. Very likely. <laughs> very, very likely. Is that another one there? Yes, sir. The side scrape this guy. I don't think he can damage me. Got him on the move. E25. <laughs> Everything I've shot at can't really hurt me that much. There's another one. Ten rounds left. Absolute bloody massacre. The King Tiger is unreal. There's nothing here in front of me, I don't think. They must be in the other spawn.
Germany suffers. Aha. I can't get my gun up high enough. That with a smoke. I've done it before, but I've never killed a plane that way. I just got shot from the front. That probably sunk quite a bit. We're flying this way, right? Yeah. Oh, yep. That's the cherry on the cake. <laughs> That is the cherry on the cake, dude. This one guy now has got his breach knocked out over here. Plenty of time left in the match. Not good. This is now my demise, probably. He's spawn predicted. Oh, he's melting. He doesn't have a very good gun, that guy, so I'm not that bothered about him. This dude over here does, though. He's hiding in this rock by the looks of it. Yeah, hello. He up my barrel. Oh, GG. <laughs> 15 kills, triple ace. Right, unfortunately we don't get to choose our maps and we're on this map again. The map rotation's been pretty crappy. Luckily it's not in terrible weather or night time. We got lucky in that regard. There's a reason why people don't like these big maps and it's because generally they're forced to play a really slow moving tank against things that can get round behind their spawn before they can even leave. When Italians were added with the wheels the entire game changed. We thought BMP1s and stuff rushing were bad. And M18s. Look at the game now. Right, we will see people on A shortly. Just gonna keep adjusting as we drive forward. So we keep 1650. Oh, I see him. That was actually pretty short. It must be the back of the cap. Now I can't see him for my own splash. A chariot here, he's actually terrifying. Glad he's dead. There's another one behind that building. He reversed. M18. I gave him a fright. Let's just check there's nobody on this water side. We got somebody up that area too. Attention to the designated grid square. Attention to the designated grid square. M18 is two of them. Damn dude, I just went over the top of that one. I mean, this guy. He's firing at me. Oh, he just dodged that. You guys probably can't even see what the hell I'm shooting at. Two M18s, if you're wondering. He's now behind the house again. I'd like to get rid of some of this ammo that I stored. So this is no problem at all. Unless he has my cupola on my machine gun port, there's nothing he can do to me, for, especially at this range. He's there. And he popped back in again. I'm trying to time this. Because he's peeking in and out. Come on. I know you want to say hello again. I would have went over the top anyway. Right, somebody is on B. Let's go. Somebody is a way out. 
flanking our spawn. IS2 is on him. A jumbo just killed our IS2 now. Panther F is waiting on who? Gonna have to get ourselves in a really dodgy position where we can be flanked easy, but we can hopefully at least see the enemy. I just spotted somebody. Bad shot. I think that's a T25. It's dead. T26. A super P. People still raining shots from up here too. Where did that come from? Let's just keep an eye out for that again. Alright, I see. He's here somewhere. Decap B. There's an enemy pretty close to me. This Panther F is cleaning up house over here. Someone's crossing open terrain. A tortoise. I aimed for this track, but I was aiming far too high. That'll kill me, that thing. I need to move out of here. I don't want to fight that. M18's on the B cap. Something else just shot me from up here. And there's another guy in this field. Dead. What shot me from over here? Do that again. Just the scupola. Who is pinging me from there? There goes the tortoise. Dealt with. The only way we know how bombs. This M18 is now pushing me. Very likely gonna appear here. T34 to my left. Exactly where he appeared from. Right, that was the guy who killed the Panther F. Let's get on B. We got MG Crossfire heading into B here. And something is definitely here. It's not this T 34. Yes, sir. Oh my god, this is a big boy. I could have just shot his lower front plate before. But the worry was that if I bounced it because I'm bad, then uh, I wouldn't have killed him. Cheap shot. Always. That is not ideal. Is that RP3s? No, it was a HVAR. 
I'm getting pushed again. Taking it easy. Nice and slow. Okay, let's see if we can find this anti here now that it's bullying our T-34. I'm lucky that guy never shot my barrel out. We've discovered the culprit. Rest in peace. Right, T-3485. I'm sorry that took so long. The enemy is on C. Let's just focus on A right now. This plane's coming back too. No, we do not. I can't hear a damn thing. I wish planes were that loud whenever you're flying a plane. Listen to that racket. Jumbo. Still scary. You're dead, right? Thank God. In fact, that looks like a friendly that's dead. Something's here. I'm gonna get shot in the back. But something is here. Scorpion. Right. We've got A cap. Let's focus this guy on C cap. There's a plane coming for me at some point. I know it. It is bound to happen. Our team is doing magnif ugh, magnificent right now. A Chaffee just killed an EBR over on A. Another M56 over this way. Okay, disregard C for now. No, I lied to you. M4A1, and I think that's a super purging up there as well. I'm going to get killed by this M56 from behind. He's backing up pretty hard. Oh, okay. Someone is on the opposite side of B. I need to, I need to get over to A. If there's another guy on C waiting to kill me, there's nothing I can do about it. We can maybe play the rest of the game, possibly. This little Chaffee's doing such a good job. He's dead though, and that's on kill him. Wait, where's this M56 at? We got a Yak 9 up. This guy is now on B. Not good. Attention to the 
I don't want to turn around here without first checking this hill. I'm going to die. Come on, Digor. Far too low. Good. Oh no, I was too far right that time. There we go. Germany's suffering once more. This guy pushing me. This has been a pretty exciting game. A lot has happened. Right, B cap boy. You are next. Something is on A. Jumbo just died. Is that a bulldog? Right, I think we're going to retake B. No, he's still there. Right, nice horn. What do you need help with, Chief? Got eight rounds left. More than enough. We're taking B back. This guy might be coming up by me. Let's just pop a bit of smoke here. And we'll drive through it. That bulldog on A is scary. Nice horn's firing at him, actually. There's a bulldog. He's just getting challenged. My transmission just got knocked out. From I don't know where, actually. I'm definitely going to die here. Oh, he tried to hit me again. He's back there. Come on. Give me steering. That BT-5's got a really good strong chance of killing this guy on A, but no, he's getting strafed. I need to find where I get shot from. They're taking C back again. I see him. No, that's an M16. <laughs> he just dodged my shot too. Oh, I clipped this cannon bottle. Okay, how are you got him? Gonna have to hunt down this M18. They capped B again. We're getting A. God, this game has been a nightmare. I'm very likely gonna get bombed. Firecrest just bombed the easiest target, thankfully. Yeah, okay. Aim to swing around. Didn't get my tracks, good. Right, we got A. We need to get back on B. Wait, there's somebody on A? I don't know what I could have done more. It was an enemy plane that got let up. We are going to lose another enemy here. Tracking horizontal. Okay, we're on C. Good. Two rounds. No, we're not on C. The enemy 
and killed our teammate on C. Well, that's a GG. I tried so hard, dude. But you can only carry German teams so far. Oh, we're on B. Okay, equalizing tickets. Good. Two ammos. They're on A. That's it. It's over. This game is done. GG. The King Tiger is awesome. I love this tank. It is so powerful in a down tier. And slight up tiers as well. It's just as good. I don't worry. Yes, I'll do a video on this thing with full up tiers as well. I'll probably do it in combination with the Bulldog that fires heat. Because no one in their right mind wants to take out first spawn a King Tiger against 7-7 seven, seven vehicles. If you haven't got to this tank yet, just play it with caution, don't be stupid, and take your time. Let the gun do the work for you, find out the weak spots of where you need to shoot tanks, and don't show the enemy any flat angles in order for them to kill you. Follow those rules, and the P-47 will bomb you. Anyway, it's been really good to touch on some World War 2 stuff again. I will be back tomorrow with some more C-Mine memes. As always, thank you guys very much for watching through here. Especially people that have lasted this long. If you wouldn't mind leaving me a little like and a comment. Even suggest the next vehicle for me to play. And to all my patrons over on Patreon. That's Matthew S, Jesse Mills, Stumpin' Bunny, Kayla White, Houndy, Gateway, Bilal, Trash Panda, Ride, Zema, Kane the Salt Lord, Viking God, Warpig, The Firepiper, Sexy, Vanny and Yogbo, Justin Darlin, Big Beard and Moose, Fork, J Tormey and Fearsome Scotsman. You guys are amazing. Thank you very much for watching. Much love and bye bye. That guy got close. There's one gone.